critical, um, and this is piece that we're, we're really looking into is um, making sure that culture and history is woven into the language as well. So far, it has been very much learning from the land, which has uh, certain pieces of that, but also acknowledging our rich history as Muncie people and, and, the, and the culture therein as well. We look for ideas from other um, other First Nation groups in, in Canada who are in a similar situation uh, as we are in terms of having low numbers of speakers, but are very vibrant on, uh, on social media and also in terms of uh, offering different uh, possibilities over the internet. Um, so people can access the language uh, through institutions. Uh, now K to 12 students within the, um, school boards can access the language over the um, over the web uh, it allows us then to offer programs through universities and colleges as well or at least to to promote and to push universities and colleges to offer face-to-face -face programming or online programming we can offer it at friendship centers which is a um, usually an urban facility where uh, indigenous people can gather for for services um, we can offer those uh, programs because now the message is coming out that there are people to support the language, there are materials to support the language. Um, and to give you an idea, without digital activism and the support of, uh, when we offered face-to-face -face programming uh, uh, for language on the reserve, on the, the Muncie, Delaware community, there'd be roughly about 30 people who would show up for weekends. But with uh, the support of digital activism and offering online We've now doubled uh, and almost tripled the numbers of people who access uh, the language during our two sessions, and we're looking forward to you know, expanding that for the third. Um, we hope to inspire students. We want to maintain those, those connections uh, that students have with their language, but most importantly, it connects family. It connects family that has been spread all over Canada and the United States, and they get to connect with um, rich pieces of their culture connect with family and of course connect with the language.